Oh my God, that is so good. Hi, I'm Duke, Duke's Chatterhouse. I'm here at Sand Point, Alaska. It's near the Aleutian Islands. Dutch Harbor's to the west and the Kodiak's to the east. Give you some kind of an idea. We're kind of in the middle of nowhere, but this is where great cod comes from and a lot of other great fish. But we're here mainly to see Pacific cod or true cod. We're gonna go out on a boat on the uh, Northern Endurance with Captain Bob Starr and just see how they catch these fish. It's gonna be an exciting trip for sure. I've never done it before. In fact, they tell me no other restaurant person's ever been up here to do this, to actually go out on the boats. We're gonna go out in the middle of the ocean. It's a three-day trip. Um, it's a little risky, but I'm willing to do it. We've got a great boat, a 110-foot boat. Should be pretty safe, we'll see. Anyway, this fish and chips that we do, the cod comes from here, and it is an amazing fish. There's no question about it. Once frozen, unlike a lot of fish that comes from China, it's twice frozen, doesn't taste as good. What you get out of here is amazing fish. You know, I've been to Alaska a lot, and, and almost every fishing trip, like this, the weather's been like this. I mean, it's unbelievable. The mayor. I would love to meet the mayor, Duke Mosgrave from Seattle. Yeah. All right. Oh, what what brings you here? I'm. Uh, I own six restaurants down there called Duke's Chowder House, and so we buy fish from here. Oh, nice. Uh, cod, uh, lots of cod. Uh, so. Uh, for our fish and chips, and we also have a taco we do with it. So we go through about 70, 80,000 pounds. Uh, well, actually, it's 160,000 pounds, yeah. So, yeah, this is a big deal for us. So I'm going to go out and boat, uh, Bob Starr's boat, the uh, Northern Endurance. Oh, nice. Yeah, so that should be pretty good. Should well, be fun. Pleasure yeah. You. yeah, all right, thank you. Good for you. Oh, it's, it's been sensational. We've been buying it for years. Right. I just never had a chance to come up. Thanks for coming. All right. All right. <laughs> okay, see you. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, this is our main. What, what made you come uh, to San Point? It just seemed like, you know, I got on this boat six years ago. Yeah. And just, that's just kind of where we ended up. Well, you're catching a lot of cod. That's right. why we're here. That's what brought us here. Well, you, you've been catching cod that we've been serving in the restaurant for fish and chips and our cod tacos. So we got to say thank you because it's an amazing, an amazing product. It, and we have so many guests that are so happy. And now they're going to get a chance to see what it is you do. Okay, we're bringing a pot in. Oh my God, I don't think I want to do this job at all. Pot's coming in, my God. It's an amazing process. What else would you be doing at three in the morning? Here comes the pot. Here we go, we got some cut. Jumping the pot back over. There we go. Wow. That's unbelievable. Boy, this is tough work. I'll tell you what. I don't think I want to do this for a living. Look at the precision these guys have. 
Look at those guys. Look at he, look, he's bleeding them right now. That is about as fast a bleed job as I've ever seen. He's like, he's like lightning fast. And these cod are still alive. This is a good sign. We're on this boat. It's unbelievable boat. It's it's the Northern Endurance, and he's these are the guys that make it happen. You just witnessed one of the one of the wonders of the world. I'll tell you, I don't understand how they do this, but it takes a lot of strength, a lot of teamwork, and you guys were phenomenal. These are fresh fish. There's a Duke Worthy cod right there. Good size. Lots of good flesh. Yeah. Beautiful. Boy, there's nothing better than being out here. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. I don't think there's a person in the world who's probably seen this. I'm talking to Armin Audet. He's a plant manager at Sandpoint Trident who's been our host for this uh, excursion we're on to find some incredible tasting cod. Do you vacuum the fish out of the hole? Is that how it works? Yeah, we, we use, uh, you know, fish pumps, wet, wet, uh, And they're wet, big, wet they're big, you know, it's like monster vacuum and, and yep. it's a, and it comes out with the water, right? So it's a fairly gentle process. They're right. not, they're not slammed on the deck. They're not, no. so they go onto a, like a, a rubber, uh, 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 conveyor belt kind of thing, isn't it? Or do they, they slide uh, on the stainless steel? You know, typically we use like a, a setup like this with a, a dewatering chute. Oh, okay. And they'll come out on that belt, and then we're able to just put them right into totes here. Okay. You know, go into totes. And then from there, with ice. From there, we we add uh, ice and sea water to make what they call a, a slush tote. And then it goes into the plant. And then it either goes, you know, straight into the plant or right. stored until we get get to it. the fish with this machine, all automated, and then at the very end they take the skin off and they can they can uh, regulate how much of a deep skin they want so that you, you get a really, really trim, a lot of white meat and no dark meat, it, which is amazing. This is a, an automated process that I have never seen before. It's pretty cool. We're seeing the, the beginning of what makes our fish and chips taste so good because we're going one step further and we're getting the loins, which is really the, the heart, the best part of the filet of the cod. Cool. All right. just a VIP, you're a VSP, a very special person. We've even created a club for you, and I want you to join it. I'll send you enticing offers, I promise to entertain you, and I'll never send you spam. Go to www.dukeschowderhouse.com and join the VSP club, very special person club. It's your kind of club. Duke's Chowder is so good, so good, so good right now, so good right now. Give it to me, let me have it, don't deny me, let me slurp it, oh, so good.